Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. My name is Ulfi and I am Microsoft Azure Cloud Engineer. In this video, I would like to share my uh, experience regarding about the programming language and scripting language on Microsoft Azure. As a Cloud Engineer, uh, I believe that we need to learn uh, scripting and programming language because it's really helpful for our daily tasks especially when it's come to the automation and configuration so what is a programming language and scripting language that we need to learn as a cloud engineer first scripting language that we need to learn as a cloud engineer is a powershell we have to master the PowerShell, especially if you're working a lot with the Windows servers on Azure, it's very helpful and also it's very uh, useful for us to know uh, PowerShell. Uh, so for anyone who doesn't know what is PowerShell, so PowerShell is built on the .NET Common Language Runtime or CLR. The PowerShell we usually use for automating the management system. It also can use for build, test, and, and deploy solution. I would recommend that to learn PowerShell on Azure from John Seville's video. I will leave the links down below for anyone who wants to learn the PowerShell from uh, the fundamental level. The second language that I would recommend it is to learn HashiCorp. HashiCorp language is used for Terraform. What is Terraform? Terraform is the open source resources as infrastructure as a code for provisioning and managing cloud infrastructure. You can provision cloud capabilities such as user, manage group, a resource group and also policies the third language that i would recommend it is yaml language yaml it stands for yet another markup language yeah it sounds confusing i know so yaml language is used for ansible and Sybil is another infrastructure as a code that used on Microsoft Azure. It's we can use Ansible to install the software, automate daily tasks, provision infrastructure, improve security and compliance, and also patch system and share automation across the organization. I talk a lot more. Uh, about uh, how to use Ansible uh, to apply the security standard on my another video which is the project experience cloud managed services I will also leave the link down below for anyone who wants to uh, learn about Ansible and security standard and the last language that I will recommend it for you to learn is Python Python is a programming language often used to uh, build website, software, automate the task, and also conduct data analysis. For uh, Azure, we can build the web apps with Python, and also we can build, train, host, and deploy models from any Python environment in Azure. Uh, services for uh, data science and machine learning. I just started learning Python with code. Uh, first girl, I registered for their uh, coding uh, Kickstarter class for Python and apps. It's an eight week course, two hours per week, and their instructor are very friendly. I really enjoy the class and it's free it is free it's a hundred percent free so if anyone here especially if you are a female or non-binary gender and you would like to learn about Python 
uh, I will leave the link down below so you can go ahead to their website check their courses it's not only Python they also have JavaScript data and web app so that's the end of my video today I would like to say thank you so much for watching I hope you learn a little bit from my video I see you on another video bye